Hello friends, welcome to Entry. I am Mirza Atishambeg, your Point Educator and today I am going to discuss the 10th October IBPS PO exams analysis of all the shifts. As you know that today is the examination day of IBPS PO prelims and I have brought you a all shift analysis of the today's exam. So let's see what the analysis of the today's exam like okay let's go ahead first as you know that there are three subjects in this examination one is quant second is reasoning and the third one is English so we will do analysis one by one okay look at this they in the first segment as we have seen in the third October shift that they were focused on DI and arithmetic problems so in this examination it is predictable because they have already done that the done the same thing now look at this they have continuously asked you 15 questions on di okay look at this whether we are talking about shift 1 2 3 or 4 so the all the shifts are on the same page that means 15 questions but today's examination was a bit of moderate to difficult level okay so as we have predicted in the analysis section we have done in the couple of days back that your coming examination your 10th October examination will be a bit of a different from 3rd of October so what I'm trying to say that they need to they they wanted to reduce the cutoff okay why because they are like a monetary uh, they, they are like an RBI and uh, they wanted to utilize the monetary policy to come down the uh, liquidity and uh, uh, cash flow what I'm trying to say is that they are behaving like an R uh, like RBI okay like RBI is manipulating monetary policy to balance the cash flow in the market similarly IBPS is uh, using the level of examination to maintain the cutoff okay look at this in the quadratic equation system they have asked you in all the except one except the third shift they have asked you in every shift all right so this was the bonus i hope most of the aspirants have done it quickly approximation was asked on couple of occasions while arithmetic problems or arithmetic uh, questions was asked on every occasion and the similar thing happened like it happened with what di section so what I'm trying to say is that they have focused on two sections. One is DI and the second one is arithmetic problem. All right. <clears throat> In fact, the shift two was a bit of moderate to difficult. Remember that. All right. And number series was skipped in only last shift and the rest of the shift will be asked. Rest of the shifts have been asked. So here is the analysis of quant section where we have seen that the paper focused on di and arithmetic segment all right they continuously asked 15 questions from di and 10 questions from arithmetic segments okay but you should remember that this question paper was a bit of moderate to difficult level so you should know that as we have predicted this cutoff will come down and it will reduce to 65 to 70 okay let's go on English section says that they were focusing on reading comprehensions, error detections and uh, what sentence rearrangement. Okay. So they were focusing on reading comprehension, sentence rearrangement, error detection. Okay. On couple of occasions they have asked fillers, word replacement. Okay. In fact, in one occasion they were asked sentence improvement while closed test was asked on couple of occasions word rearrangement so it you cannot predict that you will be getting majority of the questions from this because the majority of the questions was like between 15 to 20 okay majority of the questions was between 15 to 20 and you have to pick 10 questions from different sections like uh, phrase rearrangement word rearrangement close test and uh, fillers and word replacement sentence improvement so they can ask you on several portions you need to understand and you have to learn very efficiently 
so english portion was between easy to moderate i would rather say it was a moderate paper okay on english section i would say that it was a moderate paper all right i wouldn't say easy i wouldn't say difficult because if you going difficult you wouldn't be you wouldn't see the attempt above 25 okay but if you go to easy you will continuously see the attempt 25 but the students are in between 20 to 25 that means the paper was moderate level okay so here what i'm trying to say is that the, your accuracy will come in handy in this in this kind of examination okay reasoning look at the reasoning section it is also predictable that only one section got the majority of the questions and well, and that section is puzzle all right you will be getting puzzle you will be getting lots of questions from puzzle because it is the only way to stop a raging student which is going well so they continuously ask 20 questions in the re puzzle and seating arrangement yes on several occasions in fact uh, on several occasions they have asked coding decoded on one occasion they have asked simple one on the second occasion they have asked chinese coding decoding and in the first shift they have skipped that portion they were uh, they had asked blood relation on couple of occasions they have asked inequality syllogs syllogs was the majority of portion so they focused on puzzle and syllogs okay on miscellaneous section they were asked several questions order and ranking was asked once alphabet odd one out missed out direction based question was asked continuously so they were focusing on three sections one is puzzle second one is syllogs third one is direction based question okay and from from there you will be getting majority of the questions between 25 to 30 and from and from 30 to 35 you will see lots of options so what i'm trying to say is that that paper this paper is a bit of a moderate level i won't say a difficult level because yes you may you may say you might be uh, saying that quant section was a bit of lengthy definitely they would try to uh, they tried to make the uh, lengthy paper as i have pre predicted in the couple of days back in the uh, live session of youtube where uh, we have said that uh, you will be getting a tougher paper in the coming days okay tougher means lengthy paper you won't be getting any kind of high level lots of high level question but you will be getting lengthy questions where your speed will matter and accuracy will matter and that will frustrate you okay so that's my analysis i would say that you uh, if you have attempted between 65 to 70 that would be enough because majority of the questions was majority of the aspirants have said that they have attempted they had attempted 60 between 65 to 70 okay so that's it from my side i hope you have enjoyed this session and uh, if you like it share subscribe and comment on the section and keep watching entry